time for baseball on MLB Network. Opening day is here as we get the new season underway with a good matchup between the Boston Red Sox and the Toronto Blue Jays. Hello again everybody baseball is back welcome to our special opening day broadcast on MLB Network. I'm joined by Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak. The staffs for these two teams sure to be a focal point as this series moves along. Hey, just like any team, pitching is going to be the key factor for this ball club as the year plays out. I'm sure the staff will have its ups and downs, but putting together some quality outings early in the season could do wonders for this club getting out of the gate with a good start. The games count starting now. Opening day on MLB Network, and it's coming up next. Right now, here we go. From the belt, the pitch. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. Gone into the home bullpen for a home run. So digging in now, number seven. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Guerrero over at second. Walker at first, two out in the inning. Right here, let's go, kid. Popped up. Schweihart is calling for it. And that's the third out. Here's the first pitch to him. Drilled down the line. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but he gets by the glove down the line. Oh, but the feed to the shortstop is off the mark. And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base. And now a crucial spot. Bases loaded. Two men gone. And that'll bring up a man who's a human highlight reel defensively, Kevin Pillar. Hit back up the middle. And he has delivered one of the biggest at bats of the afternoon as he cashes in with a base hit. Ah, but the throw is well up the line, and a second run's going to score. So stepping in, number seven. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. First pitch on its way. Good curveball there gets the swing and miss. Hey, this pitcher better be careful right here. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite field. Fouled off. Bases are empty here with two men out. Hot shot on the ground is short. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Six to four, the outcome today. The Toronto Blue Jays wrote an important sixth inning to victory in this one. Marcus Stroman earns his first win of the season. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Boston Red Sox and the Toronto Blue Jays. It's Blue Jays baseball, and it comes your way next.
and he rides that storm out all the way through the end. It'll be interesting to see what kind of start he gets off to this year. First offering on its way. Hit hard on the ground is short. Bogarts has it. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Into the box now, number seven comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Now the first pitch here from Price. And a good pitch, but he gets quite a lot of it. And in fact, he got more than a lot of it. He got all of it. It's a home run. Into the box now, number seven. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But hey, listen, a home run is a home run. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Bradley is there. Two down. Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with the victory and look on to the next one. Three to one, the final score this afternoon. Toronto used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Aaron Sanchez gets the win on the mound, his first of the year. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Ought to be a good one here between the Baltimore Orioles and the Toronto Blue Jays. Blue Jays baseball starts right now. Stepping in for the Jays, number seven. He had a couple of hits in yesterday's contest. Right here. Here's the first pitch to him. Right through oh, it here. He's behind 0 and 1. Hey boys, you talking about getting your A swing off right here? That's what it looks like. A guy with massive power letting it eat. High in the air and deep to left center field. And that one is gone. Trying to pick things up where we left we off. Number seven as we move past the halfway point in this one and begin the bottom of the fifth. Yeah, and his last at bat, he hit a changeup out for a home run. So it'll be interesting this A.B. to see if they give him a steady diet of fastballs. Big swing, but he just gets a piece of it. Strike one. The windup and the 0-1. This is line to left. Therefore, it is Mancini, and that's the first out of the inning. Stepping in and ready for another shot, number seven. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Fouled away. Get your pitch. Come on, baby. Get your pitch up. Stay through. Let's go. And he fouls this one off. Hey, good one up there, huh? Here's the 0 and 2. Line drive to left. But this will hang up a bit too long as it's taken in chest high. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Tonight's ball game comes to a close. Three to one the final. The Baltimore Orioles jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Bo Paulino gets the win on the mound his first of the year. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Baltimore Orioles and the Toronto Blue Jays. It's Blue Jays baseball, and it's on its way next. Now at the plate, number seven. He drove in his club's only run a night ago. Wait for your pitch. 
First delivery to him on the way. Ready with the 0-1. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. Throw won't get him. Ready with the 0-1. Runners on his way to third. Looped out towards short. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. He'll get it into second. On to second, but he's in safely. To the plate now is the designated hitter, number seven. An RBI double is what he was credited with his first time around. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next A.B. To third. He's got it. And that's the first down. Digging in once again, number seven. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Number seven. Hey, let it rip, let it rip, let it go. First offering on its way. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Yeah, they could only manage two hits against him the entire game. So they were never really in a position to even challenge him. Rock solid win and a memorable performance. Tonight's game comes to an end. Five to one, the final score. The Toronto Blue Jays jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. It's the home opener of this new season between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Number seven. Striding into the box, number seven. He was hitless in yesterday's shutout loss, as were many of his teammates. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. And he just couldn't keep that ball fair as it winds up a long foul ball. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right Let's side as the count will move to 0-2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Here's a swing and a long drive high in the air and deep to center field. A leap, but he can't bring it back into the park. It's a home run. So it's a solo shot to dead center. Fourth home run here in the early going as the Blue Jays take a 2 to nothing advantage. Stepping into the box, number seven. And he's off to a hot start in this one. Homered his first time around. The last at bat, Matty D, we heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. Hey, be patient. Pick one out and drive it, kid. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Hit sharply toward the right side. Polanco is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. At the plate, number seven. He comes in one number for two seven. with that home run he hit earlier. Hey, come on now. One time. Right here. Here comes the first pitch. This is line to left. Dickerson is going to get there as he backs up to put it away. Now to the plate, Leading number off. seven. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. Come on, big guy. One time. Here we go. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Drilled right back up the middle. And that'll get on through into center field, so he's got himself a leadoff single. Digging in and looking for more. Number seven. He went deep Number earlier, seven. and he's two for four to this point. Right 
First pitch coming. Here it is. And this is lined hard to deep left. And he will make the catch while ranging backward. Yeah, that's what you want to do when you're playing on the road. Take it right to the home squad and get a win. Now the pressure is off. If they get one of the next two, the series is theirs. Seven to one the final today. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Pittsburgh Pirates. It's Pirates baseball on the show next. Stepping into the box, number seven. And he's been swinging the bat really well in April. He's got that average up over 350 to start the new season. This guy's having a really good year for his age, but this is something we've seen a lot lately. Young players coming up and impacting a lineup. Here's a swing, and oh, man. Way out of here. It's a two run shot to straight away left home run number five on the year as the Blue Jays take a two to nothing advantage. Next will be the cleanup hitter number seven number runner in seven. scoring position with Sugan. We all know this guy's a real good fastball hitter. We saw how far he could hit one. He got a fastball that he liked and he turned that thing around and it got out of here in a hurry. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hangs on him a bit that time as it's belted out toward deep center field. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And this one is gone. A home run. So a two run shot to left center is second of the game as the Blue Jays have opened it up further now four to nothing. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And that's cut on and missed 0-1. What I love right there is just the freedom in that hack. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. Shot back up the middle. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Riding in once again, number seven. Already a pair of long balls on his line in this one, so we'll see what else he has in store here. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Rip down the line. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. The 0 1 pitch. Line drive to center field. And he will get there as he had to cover a lot of ground. Hey, it's hard to win games at any point, but to win games on the road, especially in this ballpark, so they are very happy with this win. 7-2, to two, the final score this afternoon. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Boston Red Sox. Major League Baseball on the Show starts now. Standing in, number seven. He turned in a four for four line in the game yesterday, so we'll see how he backs that up here. Let her rip right here. Let's go. First offering on its way. Owen won the count. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Hot shot to third. Devers gloves it. Over to Nunez for the force, and that ends the inning. Let's go. Right here. Digging in, number seven. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Number seven. All right, one time, one time. Here you go, see it up, let it fly. From the belt, the pitch. To short, hit hard. Nunez. On to Moreland, and they roll two to end the inning. 
Ready once again, no number seven. And he's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Hey, let the can up there, kid, huh? Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Ranging back is Bradley, and it bangs off the monster. He pulls into third safely. First delivery to him on the way. Hit high and deep out there to left center field. Ranging back is Bradley, and it's gone into the monster seats. So a solo shot here to left center field. Eighth home run on the season for him. And it's now six to four. Four wins in a row for these guys. And I'm sure they're feeling pretty good about themselves. We'll see how long they can keep this up. A six to four finish in tonight's affair. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Boston Red Sox. It's baseball, it's the show, and it comes your way next. Digging in, number seven. It was a two-hit effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. All right, one time. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. A bouncer to the left side. Bogarts has it. Throw to first. He'll be That's in time. Out. And there's one gone here to start the second. First pitch of the at bat. No balls in one strike. Oh, baby. See you driving. A swing and a ground ball to third. Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. Throw on to first gets him, and the side is retired. First pitch on its way. Hit in the air down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Line drive to left. Benintendi is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Hey, your turn now. No Here's the first pitch. Oh, this is hit high and deep out to left. And it's off the green monster. The throw into second. The tag, and he's nabbed trying for two. Stepping in, number now seven. Back. He was thrown out number at second seven. trying to stretch a base hit into a double in his last at bat. Yeah, I'm not sure what they saw right there. Maybe the first base coach was giving him the green light to go ahead and go to second get base, down, but down. obviously it didn't work out in that situation. It did take a good throw to get him, though. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our top player of the game. Yeah. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Ought to be a good one here between the Milwaukee Brewers and the Toronto Blue Jays. Interleague Baseball comes your way next. Here comes the first pitch. Hits it high and deep out to center field. Kane going back, and he makes a nice catch. Settling in now, number seven. Now 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Wait for a good one now. First pitch of the at bat. This is line to left. Yelich is going to get there as he backs up to put it away. Striding forward now is the DH, number seven. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. Here's the first pitch to him. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And it's gone as they add still another. Coming forward now, the Toronto designated hitter, number seven, runner in scoring position with two gone. 
Yeah, and that last at bat, Matty, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But, hey, listen, a home run is a home run. Big swing, but he just gets a piece of it. Strike one. But facing right-handed pitching so far in this season, number seven is hitting over 400. Doesn't matter if you're talking about a series of games or a whole. And he might have another one as this is hit high and deep out to left. And that is off the wall. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. Now batting number seven. He went deep earlier, and he's two for four to this point. Number seven. Here we go, here we go. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And this is lined right back up the middle. And that's through into center field. So the tying runs aboard to kick off the inning. Yeah, and that's just a punch to the gut of the home fans as they watch their team fall behind at the top of the ninth. Then they can't get it done at the bottom and come away with a loss. A close one, 9-8 to eight at the end of the game in this one. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Milwaukee Brewers and the Toronto Blue Jays. Interleague Baseball, next. Next will be the designated hitter, number seven. He's coming off a three-hit performance in the loss last night. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-1. Oh, and here's a fastball right down the middle of the plate that swung on and hit out to deep left field, and this one's not coming back. This is a long home run. Leading off the inning, number seven, and they'll need him to get something going here. The last at bat, Matty D, we heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. But it bends just foul into the second deck. Now a ball pulled hard but fouled off to the left. Oh, that's frustrating right there. He was right on that fastball. Took it deep. Just pretty well struck high and deep to left field. Looking up is Yelich. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. Stepping in, number seven. Already a pair of long balls on his line in this one, so we'll see what else he has in store here. Here we go one time, like a big dog. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. High and deep to straightaway right. Looking up is the right fielder. Still going back. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. Well, the skipper has to be pleased. They go on the road and win the first two of this three-game series. Playing for the sweep tomorrow. 12 to 6, the final tally here. Milwaukee get the win on the heels of four home runs. Brent Suter gets the win on the mound his first of the year as he turns in eight strong innings of work. Damian Lyon couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.